this uh, tutorial is going to be the continuation part of my previous tutorial in which I have taught you that how to plot a single region inset or zoom in plot uh, from a FITS image of uh, Sloan Digital Sky Survey uh, FITS image data. So, this tutorial is uh, one step ahead in which I will be teaching about multiple region inset or zoom in uh, plot uh, from the same uh, FITS image data. So, my uh, advice or recommendation is that if you are a new uh, to this channel or this video, then go and watch my previous tutorial in which I have uh, done the uh, coding uh, of uh, single region plotting in a very organized uh, manner. Right? Otherwise, you will not get uh, the crux of this coding without watching my uh, previous tutorial. So, it will be a very better idea for uh, you also. So, now uh, let us start uh, the coding stuff. Okay, so this will be step 9. So, in uh, my uh, previous tutorial, I have gone up to, a, up to a step 8, okay? So, what I will do, I will not like do the coding from the beginning. So, I will go to the step, uh, step 6 in which I will like do the plotting, right? And then I will, I will copy paste these uh, codes, okay? So, I will go to the step 6 and I will copy uh, this uh, coding part and paste in the uh, step 9 ok right and then I will uh, do some modifications so for uh, that first of all I will like using a for loop right so for loop is a only way Alright, uh, so here I will define uh, four uh, different inset uh, regions, right? So I will uh, give my regions as uh, regions variable equal to and give uh, four sets of your xy coordinates, right? So I will choose the first one, this xy coordinates. After that, the second one. You can choose uh, any uh, your xy pixel uh, coordinate, but uh, make sure that uh, it contains some uh, objects. So, right. So, second one is 365230. And then third one you can choose as uh, 510 and 460. And then fourth one you can choose as uh, 1290 and 310. So close it as a square bracket and make it so that it can take uh, xy value simultaneously. Right? So this becomes basically your, uh, your xc and uh, yc. Right? So what I will do, I will just block block here this uh, part, and then I can give the box size. Okay, so correspond to this uh, for uh, x and y c. So give it as a 20, 45. Sorry, what is? Yeah. So 20, 45, uh, 30, and uh, 25. Right. And then you can make it as an array. So np dot array. Now uh, I will be uh, defining uh, these uh, different colors and uh, 
different locations uh, for uh, for these uh, regions. So let me define the locations, right? So define here inset a uh, location, right? So inset uh, locations. Insert locations equal to you can give a uh, say uh, first is your uh, upper right, second one you can give a uh, say lower uh, center, lower center, right. Uh, third one you can give upper center upper center and fourth one you can give a lower right so these are the four positions of the your um, zoom in plot right after that you can give some uh, edge colors right so you can give edge colors to distinguish so you can give say you can give here red you can give green you can give blue you can give black right so these are uh, four uh, colors you are defined uh, for the edges now I'll be using a for loop okay so now um, now use for loop okay so for loop uh, for your box size insert location and edge colors simultaneously so for that type here command for i and then for x if i see right and you need to take all uh, loops together so you can uh, give here comma your uh, you can go to the uh, box size okay go to the box sizes you can go and um, make it say box size right for multiple right after that uh, you can choose uh, choose your insert locations right so Mm, insert locations and then your edge colors right and then you want to uh, give it in a, a like uh, you want to give in in a uh, simultaneously uh, to work it so type here enumerate and then give in a zip format and you can pass your all uh, say regions then you can go to your um, box sizes and then you can give say insert locations and then you can go to the edge color site complete the uh, complete the for loop right and then you need to give the correct uh, correct spaces as a tab okay so tab and then block this line of code and And you need to like change some uh, stuff here. You need to uh, give here say uh, edge color equal to give here um, edge colors right. And then you want to give here uh, say location. So locations you can give here um, with the location. So, yeah, so location you can give. Okay, so you need to copy this. Uh, line of code also right so open this line of code here and 
put it uh, here right and then you can give location equal to insert uh, locations right so now uh, it looks fine uh, and then block this line of code here so yeah you can block this also so let it give in and now uh, run the code what is mistake here there is some locations issue so maybe yeah there should be er okay there should be er not uh, re yeah so here you can see that i have got images but it is not working properly so let me check what is the mistake here so there is some uh, mistake here let me check here so yeah we have this uh, plotting stuff and image is there i think we need to plot these uh, uh, inset axis uh, on top of that so copy this uh, comment it and go on the top and then you can plot it so here you can see that here is your stuff uh, looking uh, quite uh, good right so maybe you need to some change some uh, do some changes so go here make it uh, 30 percent and make it 40 percent so this is how uh, things will uh, look like okay so you can also uh, you can also like change some locations of these boxes so you can make it say uh, upper left if you want the first one upper left so this will appear here and you can make it yeah it's fine i think now it is uh, fine okay and then you can change the line style you can make it say uh, solid right so this is how it will look like and you can also change the line width okay so you can make it say five so it is like much more uh, bold looking okay so I will make it only uh, two. That's fine. Okay. You can give your edge colors. You can change it, and you can also change the location of these uh, connecting uh, lines. Okay. So make it here uh, three and uh, two. So see how it will uh, get connected. So now it is connected in this uh, in this fashion. So you can also change the location of the connection to the line to the main plot. And this is how uh, things will be done in a correct way. So let me review the code once again. So I have uh, these four regions uh, which I bring your center uh, xc and yc. Then I have like four box size. Uh, then you have like their locations and their edge colors. Then I have done. Uh, simultaneous looping uh, through your box size uh, regions locations and edge colors to plot this uh, inset uh, or zoom in plot okay so here's your inset axis then i have the main plot right and uh, then i have this uh, inset plot then i've set the limit in the box region and then finally i have uh, marked the uh, inset using your edge color and a liner style so this is my final product so you can reproduce uh, using my code and if still it is not going to work with you then uh, you can uh, seek help from me in the comment section i will be happy to help you so thank you and stay tuned for the next videos